What up, After Buzzers? It's your boy DJ Jesse Janity here at NBC Universal, and I'm so excited because we have two of the stars of <laughs> Bravo's new show, The Real Housewives of Dallas. Y'all, what can we expect from this show this this season? I mean, we got Potomac, we have Atlanta, but what are you ladies gonna? Yeah, I know we haven't seen what Texas is. Oh, you like roller coasters, like the big ones at Six Flags? It's kind of like that without the bar, and you gotta raise your hands in the air. When yeah. you do the loop to loop. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So now, obviously, bringing a whole group of women together, you know, there are some empowering you moments. Mean something happens when you get women together, not always in a good way. On Bravo? I'm shocked. With champagne and that time of the month, and yeah. you never know what's going to happen. Yeah. So we always see, uh, you know, on the Housewives shows, the glitz, the glamour. What does Texas have to offer? What are we going to see on that side of it? I'm, I, I have no idea. I've never well, everything's been. Everything's bigger in Texas. Yeah. I it mean, is. we're called Big D for, for big drama. <laughs> yeah. Number one. But we have, you know, everything you find in Dallas is big. I mean, our attitudes, our bank accounts our hair, uh, the amount of time that we go out, and the compassion in our hearts. Yeah. I mean, what I love about the city is we are one compassionate, charitable city. Big hearted. And I'm proud Dallas of that. Dallas is very big hearted. And I lived here in LA for 16 years, so what grew that up that? in Texas. I just yeah. moved back when all of this came about. Yeah. So just reconnecting. We've known each other for 30 years. Yeah. And uh, friendship. long friendship. Long friendship. Are you so two the only two that, uh, are you, got, you two the only two connected? No, no Stephanie and Brandy pair. are best friends. Okay. Yeah. And their husbands are best friends. Okay. Yeah. yeah. But you guys weren't connected with them. Not, not so much before this. Okay. No. They knew each other from the charity world. Yeah. I'm kind of like the new girl in town that is getting to know everyone, and and Dallas. Yeah. I'm a different woman but now, and it's a different. Yourself, it's it's yeah. been it's a lot of adjusting. Honey, I remember I'm the tired. first time she came in, I'm I was tired. like, okay, honey, we've got three charity events tonight, I'm tired. and tomorrow we've got two. And I'm so, like, and I got like, one a month. Okay. Can I go to she one goes, of mine? She goes, I'm going to one. Pick one. And I'm like, I can't drop you back off. Uh -uh. You get in the car with me. We're going to three. I like and then to I'll be at home, home in bed with my hot husband watching Netflix, binge watching. Netflix you know what I mean? show. Yeah, exactly. I, uh, and I'm, a, I'm the charity girl. I'm yeah. out every night helping charities, doing what I can to raise community awareness mm -hmm. and to, um, to, you know, to help our, our, our community. I got to tell you, in today's times, our, every community is really in need. And if you're not out there at least trying to do something, then you're just, you know, get off the sofa. Yeah. Don't lead a life of quiet Go desperation. Ahead. Go help somebody. Well, and that's a big reason why we wanted to do the show. Yeah. To give a voice to the things that we're doing, the things that are important to us. That My husband's love. a musician. He, he wants to touch people with his music. Mm -hmm. I had, we both had very tumultuous pasts. We've done a lot of healing. So okay. you so said we were word empowered. On, yes, on we want to empower women with what we've been through. And say, I girl, you know what? We've been there. If we can do it, you, you can, can do, do it. it. And I will say this. Um, you know, in the beginning, you see a lot of uh, me being a big, I'm, I'm the new Nini. Uh, you see a lot of that. But I think if you'll take the journey with me, you're really going to understand why I have that big personality, why I'm an aggressive woman, why I'm always the alpha. I mean, you she's know. Really just a kitty cat. She's a kitty hearts. cat. Yeah. yeah. She's a kitty yeah. cat on the She might That's look like I, a lion no. on the outside, I, I, yeah. but she's a kitty cat on the inside. As long as you're not pawing at me, we're fine. Well, okay, because I was going to ask, we had some of the other ladies come through here mm -hmm. and they said well we aren't the bad guy casted on the show so I was just wondering oh I hell you know it was April Fool's <laughs> when they came through right because okay. Brandy is a true redhead. Yeah, okay. she's, she's a, a firecracker. little firecracker. Yeah, and she got her. And Stephanie is her real short fuse. Instigator. Yeah, oh. big time. Yeah. She did kind of have a little. It did seem like she was a little bit of a firecracker. Yeah, yeah. And but I love her. I call. I say hey, she's a little tiny thing, and I use the term lady balls. She's got she's a got them. She got lady balls the size of Texas on that little bitty body. Yeah. And you know what? I love that. But I. And the, the thing about firecrackers is, be careful. He set them off around. You know, because yeah. I could be a fire woman and put that, you know, put that real quick. Put that <laughs> Well, I'm excited to see you all Thank have you. amazing personalities. Thank I can't you. wait to check it. Make sure you guys check The Real Housewives of Dallas on Bravo. Yeah. 